This somewhat stiff billionaire is a runaway winner, on paper at least, but he gets no bounce from his victories, hard won with hard dollars, in Ohio spending four times as much as his nearest rival. Winning is a grind, not a breeze. Tomorrow we wake up and we start again, and the next day we'll do the same. And so we'll go day by day, step by step, door by door, heart to heart. Appealing to Republican hearts, one candidate after another has been the hope of Conservatives as the anti-Romney. Each has had their day, each has faded. Now Christian Conservative Rick Santorum is the standard bearer of the right, attacking Romney's credibility. We need a person running against President Obama who is right on the issues and truthful with the American public. That message appeals in rural America. It's places like Hillsborough in Ohio that mean Romney cannot seal the deal. In places like this, they pick their politicians as carefully as they choose their cattle. The agricultural economy is booming. And issues like abortion and gay marriage have become surprisingly important in this election. I've done voting for economics. I'm for voting for values. I don't think you can ever really be too conservative, especially in this day and age. There's a new, almost militant mood. For Karen Faust, the priority is choosing a right-wing firebrand, even if that means putting off moderate voters and losing the presidential election in November. That's a chance we'll have to take. That's a chance I'm willing to take. I don't want a halfway. I want the whole sh enchilada. I don't want halfway. This is where I did a lot of campaigning. Hillsborough's Republican mayor is not your average politician. He's been a stand-up comedian for 22 years. He says people want something different. They aren't happy with the choice they have. We're looking for Clint Eastwood and Ronald Reagan wrapped up in one to come walking up and, oh my God, there he is. It's a slam dunk. And there isn't that guy. <laughs> so we have Rick Santorum. <laughs> Despite the misgivings, it was important for Romney to win this state. He's inching towards victory, but it's a hard slog against the mood of many in his party. Mark Muddell, BBC News, Ohio.